Well, hello, you trader nerds. Hope everybody's having a wonderful, 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 wonderful Thursday. It is I, or is it, it is me. It is me, Sweet Bobby. How are y'all? Real traders never trade alone. They trade with their fellow nerds. We got Matt Jolly Wally in the house. We got DB. We got Dwayne. We got Edwin. We got Hal. We got iPhone. We got Mo. We got Stacy in the house. And good to have all of you. Hope y'all having a wonderful, wonderful day. So the market is down about a half a percent on NQ. That means that we're down about one and a half percent on our TQQQ. Looks very similar to what's going on in the E-minis. E-minis are down about the same percentage, about a little less than half a percent, down 26 points. Volume looks really kind of low today. VIX is in the 14 handle. And AD, well, let's see, let me see that. Let me mute everybody. AD is at negative 179, and it is trending lower. Let's see the NQ. Looks kind of bearish here. We are overbought, and we would anticipate a move back into this area at some point in the next 10 days. That's kind of what it looks like. And I would think it's a very similar position over in the E-minis. The E-minis are also overbought. And they are at an area that may be a little bit of support, but we anticipate that we'll go in and fill these gaps in the coming days and may have a target of 59.27. Let's look at the linear regression. And apparently I put double lines on there. Don't read anything into it. I don't know why I did that. Uh, but we are in a period of consolidation before the next big move. I think because we are at the upper portion of the linear regression channel, that the next big move will be a downward move. So everything that I'm seeing looks kind of bearish, y'all. Looks kind of bearish. Let's see what our friend TML is doing today. I've been watching that a lot. And TML cannot buy a bid. Let's see. TML. Wow, it's actually up today, $1.63. How about that? Up 3.7%. So let's see. We're down a little bit in our TQQQ on the day. Our ES is up here, but down there, that's about a wash. Our TMF is up 111, but our TQQQs are down 324. Let us look at our little bitty hedges to make sure our hedges are okay. So cap requirement, go here and make sure we got the right account. And we want to look at our ES positions and our TQ and auto refresh and go to risk analysis and we want to bump this up to 40 because that's what happened on august 5th it was a 40 point move and we've got about move this to 60 percent down we got about thirty-five thousand dollars worth of protection it's like i had an order fill somewhere let's see what our activity looks like activity in the last seven days or so let's see we filled i sold two shares of bill because i had a little bit of margin interest let's see if i still got margin interest three dollars and 27 cents my cash is negative so i need to get that cash positive i don't want to pay any margin interest so we'll keep working on that let's see es filled on 11 11 i guess that was one of my gtc orders indeed it was and let's see, then we sold some more bills there. All right. Now, y'all, I want to tell you something. We have an important, very important Muscadine Mafia coming up today. We will not have Muscadine Mafia tomorrow. We will have it today. And I need to share with you some important information about the back test that came to my attention yesterday. So very, very important. It deals with our plan and I will see y'all in the Muscadine Mafia session. Everyone else, have a good day. I will see you tomorrow.